room full of people who don't recognize us I reach out for you and call out your name Oh, I know I should tell you, but you seem so happy What's up guys, it's the one, aka Curly Guy here And I am bo 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 back with another video And of course today's video, I'm finally gonna be straightening my hair I haven't straightened my hair in... I don't even know how long. It's been months and months and months. I know it's been over six months since I straightened my hair. Um, so I'm pretty excited about it. I have not straightened my hair just because, you know, it was summertime and it was hot and, you know, that's a whole thing. And then with the corona, I really haven't been going anywhere, so I really haven't felt like it. But it's a new year and I just like to start my hair off fresh, so I wanted to give myself a little bit of a trim. Even though I just trimmed my hair, so I might not actually need to trim, but... You guys, some of you guys have been asking me, when am I going to straighten my hair? You guys want to see my hair. So, I'm going to be straightening it. And this is going to be a pretty quick, to the point video because you guys have seen me straighten my hair numerous times. I'm just showing you like the products that I'm using basically. And, um, of course, I'm going to be using my Rev Air to straighten my hair because why not? It's like the best tool for blowing out my hair. I mean, I've used it non-stop pretty much to do any type of blowout on my hair ever since I got it. So, what is a regular blow dryer? Um, so, I'm going to go ahead and get in the shower and I'm going to shampoo and condition my hair with these uh, Moroccan oil, uh, these OGX Argon of Mor Argan Oil of Morocco shampoo and conditioner set. You guys know this is the OG. Um, so, I'm going to use this set to shampoo and condition my hair. It pre-pooled my hair just to put a little bit of strength back in it and I use this Miche. Um, strength protein decon deep conditioner and that has been in my hair for a little while so I'm gonna go ahead and get in the shower shampoo that out condition and then I'll come back and we can get started so just stay tuned okay guys so I'm back and I'm out of the shower my hair is clean and now it's ready to just be sectioned off so you guys know the drill I always like do my hair in four sections like that pretty much never change I pretty much never falter away from that um, so what I'm going to do is go ahead and show you guys this first section. Now the product that I'm going to be using is this It's a 10 Blow Dry Miracle Glossing Leave-In. And I've heard so many good things about it, so that's what I'm going to be using. Then I'm just going to go ahead and spray it into the section. Now it says spray it onto towel dried hair, and that's what I've done. So I'm just going to go ahead. Oh, it smells good. I'm just going to smooth it through. And then, of course, I'm going to take my trusted Tangle Teaser brush and go through to make sure it's evenly distributed. Now, this stuff is supposed to add a high shine. It's supposed to detangle, soften. You guys know how it's a 10 is. That's supposed to do 10,000 things. <laughs> and you guys know the Tresemme Heat Tamer Spray is my trusted leave-in slash heat protectant. But I'm going to try this one this time. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is go right on in with that Rev Air. Now, I do believe the Rev Air is still about $400. But let me tell you something. It will be the mo best money you ever spent. It is such an investment. But it's worth it, you guys. Like, it is so worth it. My hair has been so much healthier without using, like, a regular blow dryer and using this because it uses reverse air. Like, kind of like a vacuum for your hair. I just can't say enough about it. But I'm going to go ahead and... And as per usual, I use my Rev Air on the highest setting, in the highest heat setting. That's just what I prefer to do. I know my hair can take it, so that's what I do. Okay guys, so that is my first section done and that literally took, what, two minutes? It does not take long at all for these sections. It's literally about a minute per section. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of my sections off camera and I will be right back. So stay tuned. Okay guys, so I am back. My hair is completely blown out. And let me just say guys, in my opinion, in my humble opinion, the Rev Air is the only tool for blowing out natural hair. And let me even go further more to say, Dyson could never, like, 
I mean, I've never used the Dyson, so let me not say they could never, but the Rev Air just gets me all the way together. I don't think there's any other tool that will get my hair dry and stretched this quick. Like, I've never, like, like I said, Dyson could never. I mean, <laughs> say no more. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do now is go ahead and flat iron my hair. And of course, I'm using my Sudo one and a half inch. Um, I just like to use this flat iron just because it gets the job done quicker, in my opinion. It takes less passes. Like, I usually do uh, one or no more than two passes over a strand of hair. And that just seems to work for me the best. Um, and then I just have a rat tail comb here. So I'm just going to go ahead and start. And look at my hair. That's literally bone straight and that's one pass, you guys. So yeah, I'm just gonna keep on going. And of course, I always tap my roots a few times because that hair is new and it's virgin hair. Um, well, pretty much all of my hair is virgin hair, but that is the newest hair, so it's the most strongest hair that I have, so it's most resistant to change. So you definitely need to give it a few taps if you want your roots to be flat and to not have puffy roots, because that ain't cute. turning out so sleek um i'm really impressed at this point but i'm just gonna go ahead and finish flat ironing my hair you guys have seen me do it a thousand times so i don't have to show you the whole process i'm gonna go ahead and finish that and i will come back and show you guys the finished results so, okay guys so i am back and this is my finished result i just went on and put a little bump in my hair just because i didn't want it like to just be so bone straight i wanted to have a little bit more body and volume and bounce but this is what we're twerking with you guys my hair has grown back. It really has grown back so much. Um, and I had literally just cut off about two and a half to three inches of my hair and it's already grown back. So I'm really excited about that. That product works so good in my hair. Like my hair is really soft. And that's one thing I noticed. Sometimes when I straighten my hair, it has like a more coarse texture or feel to it, but it's so soft and I love that. But guys, let me just tell you, the GOAT. The greatest of all time. Like, this Rev Air is the GOAT. Like, no one can tell me that there is a better product out there for naturally curly or textured hair. As far as stretching it and blowing it out, nobody can tell me there's a better product for it. Um, and I definitely will leave a link down below if you guys want to check out Rev Air. As I said, it is a little bit pricey, but it is an investment. Like, I've had this thing for over a year maybe two years at this point and it is still going strong as you can see it definitely works the hair is flourishing and i'm living for it so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video this was just quick of me straightening my hair um i'll probably keep it like this for about two weeks uh because you guys know i'm going to miami this month so it won't be straight once i get there for my birthday but um yeah this is my hair i was gonna trim it but once i straightened it i realized that it still it didn't need a trim because it's still fresh from when i trimmed it so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did definitely go ahead and give me a thumbs up also let me know some videos you want to see why my hair is straight because this comes once in a blue moon i already have one that i want to show you guys but definitely stay tuned you guys for more content and just remember guys if you can't keep it curly <laughs> well not right now keep it classy Bye, guys. I'll see you in my next one. <laughs>